Okay, I'm gonna start this video off with what pretty much this thing is. This is a Quest PRR sensor, which is a passive infrared motion detector, which they pretty much use in a lot of security systems. And I got it for $9 from allelectronics.com. This is the data sheet on it, everything. And pretty much, I also bought one of these. A green strobe light. It's a 12 volt strobe light for, you know, like a vehicle. It comes with mounting holes and everything. I bought it for $9 from allelectronics.com. What we have over here is a relay, some transit, a transistor, a diode, and a resistor. And an Arduino Mega, and you could do this with any Arduino. It doesn't really matter. On the computer, we have a little bit of code that I, I wrote up, nothing special, just reads the input state. And then we have the PIR sensor up here on the wall, and it blinks when it's detecting motion. Up here, we have the light. So, if we quit moving, it should go off. Now it's off. Now the minute we move again, once the motion detector sets us, there it goes. It'll come back on. Now the Arduino's off. We'll move. It's back on. Just a little security alarm type thing that I set up, just purely out of boredom. Uh, I plan to add sound effects as soon as I get the thing for the... Arduino, the shield that allows me to add sound, and I might end up adding a siren. And I want to add email notification to where if something enters my room while I'm not home, it'll send me an email letting me know that the sensor's been tripped. Like, telling me what time it was tripped and everything. And that would be a nice feature, and so far I'm working on that one. Well, anyway, check by later for the next boredom projects.